My great-grandfather, William B. Gould, was uh, born as a uh, slave in Wilmington, North Carolina. Uh, when the war broke out, he uh, escaped from slavery uh, in September of 1862 and joined the United States Navy. Only in 1989, when I uh, went to the National Archives and got the log of his ship, did I realize that he had been enslaved. Because in the log it says, eight contraband came on board. At this time, there was not even an Emancipation Proclamation. The Supreme Court's decision in Dred Scott, which said that all blacks in the United States were not human beings, but rather property, and had no rights constitutionally. And that was still the law of the land. And so many commanders were in a quandary when uh, blacks would escape and come across lines and want to uh, fight with them. Some of the commanders returned the slaves to the Confederates. One of Lincoln's generals hit upon this idea. We will call them contraband. They are seized property. And that is why they can come and fight for us. He commences uh, the story after he boards the ship and he said, I took a pledge of allegiance today to Uncle Samuel. He always calls our Uncle Sam, Uncle Samuel. I heard the glad tidings that the stars and stripes had been planted over the capital of the defeated Confederacy by the invincible Grant. While we honor the living soldiers who have done so much, we must not forget to whisper for fear of disturbing the glorious sleep of the many who have fallen, martyrs to the cause of right and equality. At five o'clock, I received my discharge, three years and nine days in the service of Uncle Sam. I'm glad I am to receive it, paid $4.24. So ends my service in the Navy of the United States of America, September 29, 1865. This is the last date in the diary. He stands as an inspiration, I think, particularly for uh, young people who are sometimes disillusioned, despairing, discouraged, to look at this man and say, uh, isn't this something, doesn't this man uh, point the way for something that I could do with my life? Uh, they can learn that uh, it's perfectly proper to infuse this with patriotism, to be supportive of the United States of America. That's the way he was, they can learn that it's so important to act upon the convictions that you have.